You know, the fun part about starting a new year is the number of articles and interesting uh, information that comes out at the very beginning. Uh, take uh, January 2013. Um, one of the most interesting articles I picked up was one from VentureBeat. Uh, they wrote an article on Facebook fans, um, basically talking about how the number of fans um, that a Facebook page has um, may have fans from different segments that may not really exist or tie into the business. Um, what's happened, and you may want to check out this article basically, uh, what's happened is, is that um, is making some changes in uh, reporting in terms of trying to report on segmentation to some of their larger brands. Um, Facebook is discovering where there may be a fan base that um, may potentially be fake or something that doesn't quite line up with the business. Um, a really good example of the article was with uh, the airline Lufthansa. Um, just to quote a couple of numbers here, uh, mentioned that 12% of its uh, fans come from Indonesia and 8% come from Pakistan. Now that would be great except for one thing, the airline doesn't fly to either one of those countries. Um, now that may not necessarily be uh, a fake fan base. That could be um, fan, that could be customers who maybe have an interest in that brand that may want it to come to one of its local airports. So you, you can kind of imagine that scenario. But when Facebook mentions that 83 million um, of some of the accounts are fake, uh, that's a cause for concern. Um, I think it's also a reflection of where we are with the internet um, in terms of gaming. I mean, this has been a long-standing problem. If you go back to when um, paid search and search first became very, very popular, um, you had a number of uh, SEO, <laughs> with quotations around it, um, who would try to use uh, paid links as being um, the way of gaming the system. If so we had uh, sites with all these links and connections which um, um, really were not necessarily beneficial or even connected to the business. Uh, with fans, um, obviously it's just another step in that direction. And we also see that with Twitter in terms of Twitter fans as well too. Um, but what do you think? Um, do you think that these type of uh, um, articles uh, changes your opinion of how valuable data can be from social media? Share your thoughts here on allanalytics.com.